for today's craft you're going to need some plain white paper, some brown paper or um, the back of a cereal box, some cardboard, something like that, some yellow paint, a brown pen and a black pen, and some bubble wrap. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to take our bubble wrap and we're going to use it as a brush, so not too heavily because we want to leave some of the gaps unreached. We're just going to dab it in the paint a little bit until we've sort of covered the bubble wrap but not too much. And then we're going to dab it onto our paper to make it a painting. Okay, I might have got a bit carried away in the middle. Um, <laughs> I've got a bit heavy handed, but there you go. I've left quite a lot of white space around the edge. And you'll also notice that it's not a nice neat shape. It's all higgledy piggledy and jaggledy. Now the next part, you're going to need uh, to be very careful you don't get too messy because we're going to use our thumbs, this is my thumb, to paint as well. So we're going to just use our thumbs and put them in the paint just a little bit. Ah, oh, messy. We don't want too much paint on our thumbs, but that probably looks about right. And then you're just going to make three or four little thumbprints in the white space around what you've done already. Of course you can do more than that if you'd like. And now we need to let that paint dry. So you'll have to come back and finish this later. Okay, that's looking about dry. And um, I should have said at the beginning of this that you will also need some scissors and glue for this. Um, and that's what we're gonna use next. And we're gonna take our brown paper or our brown card or whatever it is, and we're just gonna cut out a, uh, a sort of arch shape. Something like that. We're going to put some glue on the back of that and we're going to stick that at the bottom of our picture. Then we're going to grab our pens, so we're going to start off with our brown pen and we're going to sort of try and follow the outline and we're going to try and follow the outline of what we've painted. And now with our black pen we're going to finish this picture off and as I do this you're going to realise what it is I've been making. Maybe you've guessed already, with our black pen I will show you just in case you still haven't worked it out. So we're going to do some happy little faces. Some little wings. And then some black stripes. And if you want you can give them a little sting on the back as well. Should have, should have really filmed this like that. And there you go, some happy little bees buzzing around their beehive and inside is all the little honeycomb 